for that to happen. That is why they have big litters. There's two different prides that we see regularly. They're resident here all the time. Uh, both prides have three lionesses. One's got six cubs at the moment. This one now, say, with seven cubs. Uh, three dominant males, dominant over both prides. And then we've got four other males that are coming in, pushing into the area to try and take over the territory, which is why this pride split up. It ran in different directions when the four other males came in. And that's what's unfortunately lost them that cub. Um, and despite that, they're still doing pretty well. So these cubs will do nine months? One year. One year. One year. Uh, last count, it was five males and three females. I don't know what sex the cub they found was this morning. Is it uh, usual for a hyena to go after a lion? Rather than going after like yeah, uh, they're trying to eliminate competition, yeah. so that's typical. Yeah, well, one, of the, one of the uh, biggest cause of death of, of uh, lion cubs is hyenas. Because she's full, <laughs> big full stomach, she can't uh, take deep breaths, she's going to be quite hot, you know, if you eat too much you get warm. That's an enormous warthog. Is that exceptional that she's taken it down by herself? Or no, no, a warthog is about all right for a female uh, or a lioness. A male leopard as well would be able to take a warthog that big. Put up a bit of a fight. Yeah, especially with those tusks. Yeah, yeah she'll have to avoid the tusks, but uh, you know, what the, the lions would generally do is uh, you know, bite to the back of the neck, break the neck, paralyze it. Yeah. Uh, leopard would have to go for the suffocation technique because it's a little bit smaller than a lioness, not as powerful. So a leopard would actually have to fight a lot harder to get a warthog than a lion would. A coffee, baby. Just want to go put your hand around and hug it. <laughs> so she would be, what, uh, 200 kilos? No, 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 100 and 120 around there. No, no male lions are 200 kilos. Okay, so that there's a yeah. single difference. Yeah, big big difference. And the leopard would be 90, 80, 90? Yeah, an exceptionally big male would be that big. Oh, so, okay. Yeah, so uh, six, 60 to 80 is average for a male, and uh, 30 to 40 for a female with, wow. with, with leopards. Yeah. yeah. And at that age, the cubs are just not involved in the trip? No, they're, they're not s efficient hunters until they're about two and a half years old. So whilst there are those new males coming in, these cubs are, are very uh, at risk from being killed. Yeah. Uh, as long as they're dependent on the yeah. mother for food, then the mother won't come into estrus. So then they need to learn to hunt very quickly if there's a chance of a takeover. Yeah. Now, luckily for this pride, the third lioness um, doesn't have any cubs. There's two lionesses, four cubs each. third lioness doesn't have any, so she actually took care of all of the four males when they came in. She ran off with them and let them all mate with her, kept them away from the pride, uh, only for one of the cubs to get killed by a hyena. That's quite unfortunate. She, she was so well at keeping the males away, and then uh, one gets taken out by a hyena.
Very cool. Meat is beginning to get a bit scarce there now, and they're getting a bit upset with one another. Even though their stomachs are all full. Et puis ça te jeûne. 